Yo, hello guys and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial guys, I will be showing you how to install Amazon Pay plugin for WooCommerce in 2023. Amazon Pay is a popular payment method used by millions of customers in worldwide. And integrating it into your WooCommerce store can increase incredibly the customer satisfaction in sales. In this video, we will walk you through the step-by-step -step process of installing the Amazon Pay plugin for WooCommerce so you can start accepting payments from Amazon customers on your website. So without no further talking, let's get started. So the first thing that I will need you to do is go ahead and launch your website. So go ahead and open your WooCommerce store. For me, I'm just going to go to my local host because I have my WooCommerce store in there. So it's just going to launch the dashboard from here. As you can see, now go to here, dashboard, and let's go back. Here, as you can see, I have the WooCommerce plugin in here. To be able to add the Amazon plugin, all you have to do is simply click over here on the plugins and then click on add new. So that's pretty easy. After that, you can download the Amazon plugin in two ways the first one which is by clicking on add plugins and upload the plugin from here so click on upload plugin and it will show you this page like so here you can choose a file from your pc so you can download amazon plugin from a website and then drag it and put it over here and then click on install now from here and it will be installed let me show you a quick example so go to here and search for amazon uh, for WooCommerce and here we go now all you need to do is go to Amazon Fulfillments for WooCommerce for example and like that you just have to get it from here there is also for example let's search for it Amazon Payments so let's search for it here we go Amazon Pay this is another plugin you can get it for free so all you have to do to get it click on here and then click on proceed to checkout so it is pretty easy after that fill these informations and then go over here and click on pay it will be zero dollars so they will not ask you for any credit card or something like that and then they will take you to this page here you'll have two things either adding it automatically to your site or downloading the plugin as a zip file and then you can just add it manually so this is the first thing. The, the second method, which is by going to here to the keyword and search simply by Amazon, and then you will find it over here. So here it is, WooCommerce Amazon Pay. Just click on here to be able to actually download it. So click on install now, and then give it some time until it is fully installed. So now it is installed. Then click on activate from here. They will take you now to the page of plugins so just wait a little bit and let's give it some time here we go and now they will take us to the page of plugins so here we are let me just close this and so here we are guys now click on active to check if the plugin is activated so let's search for it WooCommerce Amazon Pay here it is now just click on settings so here we go and let's now go to settings to see of all the settings that you have in amazon pay first of all here you will have an important note before you sign up so here before you start the registration make sure you sign out of all amazon accounts you might have use an email address that you have never used for an amazon account if you have an amazon seller account sell it on amazon sign out and use a different address to register on amazon payments account so let's do this here what i'm going to do is simply choose the payment region so here i'm going to choose for example united kingdom united states japan or europe region i'm going to click on connect to amazon pay choose a country let me just choose for example here um, french create an amazon payment merchant account and then simply all you need to do is click here put the name password and just create an account really quick so let me just copy like an email for mine here we go let me just copy this go here 
and let's try this one here I'm going to use the password and here the another password now click on here to create an account which is pretty easy so click in here and then they will send you like an email into your email so let's check it out here we go this is my gmail amazon copy this go here and enter it now we have created our amazon account the next thing what you have to do is get your enter your mobile number so we can click in here to cancel if you didn't want and finally you just have to log in again to your account but eventually they will ask you like to enter a correct number so all you will always have to put a number to be able to log into your account so once you set up your account and you connect it and you send here you will be all good and set up to start doing everything in your payment over here so let me refresh the page real quick after you enable everything and you connect here is the title that will be showed when someone want to pay using amazon pay this is the description that will show and here is some details when you will get them only when you connect to amazon you will have here your merchant id your store id public key id and this one it will be up to you to change it to yes or no here you will have payment capture you will have some settings that you can like set it up by your own later on so you can edit it on what will satisfy your customers or your website or you for example the best and this all when you finish all of this make sure to go over here and click on save changes and finally if you have like a problem here your shop currency is it does not match with amazon so here you will have to go to your store and choose the payments from usd to euros so for example let's go to general i think as i remember and i think it's gonna be somewhere around here so yep here it is so here let's change it to euro shift changes and now i'm going back to amazon so let's go to payments and it's gonna be here so manage as you can see we have to remove this the first problem so here amazon pay is enabled but a CSS certificate is not detected so the ssl certificate is necessary for your website so your amazon can work you only can get it by buying it for me i have a local host so i don't have like the https that's why i don't really need it but for you guys you will really have to need it and here is now enabled for all comments and ready to accept payments please check the configuration to make everything correctly so you can click here to make fix everything and make it correctly as i showed you before so yeah guys that is pretty much it if you have any questions make sure to leave them down below in the comment section i will make sure to answer all of your problems and questions so thank you guys for watching leave a like and subscribe and see you guys in the next videos